Hello and welcome to a special trend whoring episode of, um, well, whatever this channel is about. Games, sour peppers, all that stuff. Right now I am currently trying, oh, focus on the phone, uh, can't reach. I'm trying to download a VPN so I can kind of sketchily get Pokemon Go. And then we're going to go out in the world. What you doing, Simba? What you doing? The App Store is being a bit of a dick, though. I also think I have a telephoto lens on this thing at the moment. But yes, this is the world of of Czar Peppers. That's the microphone I record on. That's my guitar. This is my computer that is on a Google search for how to download Pokemon Go when you're not in a region where it's actually released for. And this is my computer. See? Look inside. You can look inside, or well, I guess you can't. You can see the graphics card light, though. Alrighty, it has downloaded. It was a pain in the butt because I'm in Canada and it's not available in Canada yet. So I had to make it. Well, let's not go over the things I had to do to get this. This is gonna be really difficult holding this camera and doing this. Um, I want to look at that. Hello. Yay, I'm in. I guess I'll have to do this first. And all the servers are busy. Well, I guess I'll try this again later. Alrighty, I'm in. Um, I'm a bit new to this actual filming with a camera thing, but here we are. Hello there, I am Professor Willow. I'm sure everyone's seen this bit like a thousand times by now. Seems like all I can do at the moment is admire myself in my red rather limited choices for clothing. Not exactly my ideal. But then again, I am wearing pajamas and a plaid shirt right now. Um, okay, now what happens? I'm having to focus with my chin too, because all my hands are free. Which works, kind of. All right, let's do something. Let's do something, pokey guy. All right, we are in, and apparently there are Pokemon nearby. I got some Pokeballs. I don't want a fucking. I want Charmander. Hello, Mr. Charmander. Yes, camera on. So you can look at the floor. Because I'm on the floor right now. Okay, where are you, Charmander? Where are you? Oh, I guess I gotta look around for him. There you are. There you are. Okay, this is gonna be hard using my chin to focus. And I'm gonna get you. Oh, man. Okay, I'm gonna actually look at the screen. Go! Oh, come on, that was totally right on. Oh, screw you. This is hard. Come on, it's hitting him. This is like Angry Birds, but... Okay, flick! There we go. I got you, Charmander. One, two, I remember this from the original game. I'm feeling all nostalgic now. Gotcha. Awesome. What do you think, Simba? What do you think of my Pokemon? You know, my last cat, who just passed away, like, about a year ago, his name was Meowth. So, I got it when I was, like, um, uh, eight, nine, eight or nine, maybe ten. And I remember when I told my friend that I named him uh, Meowth, he was like, you're going to regret that one day and I did for a while until it became ironically cool and then eventually became nostalgically cool so it all worked out in the end but anyways we've got our Charmander registered to the Pokedex can't read anything through the camera Charmander 10 out of 10 HP weighs 14.31 kilograms um, and he, he does some stuff so that's good all right, now we're on the street. Congratulations, you caught your first Pokemon. You are such a talented... Yes, I know. I know. Uh, the nickname of the... Um, let's just name myself Peppers. Someone's probably already taken that, though. Yes. And it's taken. Is it? Yeah, it is. All right, we'll go with Zara Peppers. Alrighty, so since it was raining all day, I am doing this at night. 
and we are heading out in the Pokemobile, which we are about to start. Here we go. There we go, there we go. You know, I was watching a video early today of somebody else playing this game, like a guy with like a million subscribers, 11 million subscribers, doing this in his Audi R8. Since I have 1,300 subscribers, the Chevrolet, the Chevrolet Caprice classic station wagon is going to have to suffice. All right, here we go on our Pokemon journey in the car. I've got the music going through the radio. I should probably turn that down. Oh, suspension needs to be replaced on this thing. And off we go. We're gonna go find a nice place out in the country or something and hunt some Pokemon in the Caprice. This is the 1988 Chevrolet Caprice station wagon, equipped with wood paneling. You can probably see some stuff. I probably can't see shit outside. Um, I probably won't do that much recording tonight because it's, ooh, the stars are very nice and it's almost a full moon because it's not really the most ideal time, but we'll see what we can do, find some Pokemon. I really want to find a Meowth. That's my goal for tonight, is to find myself a Meowth. So I should probably, I really wish I had a GoPro with a head strap because holding this while driving is not a brilliant idea. I don't know where I'm gonna go. Let's go to Nanaimo. I'm not gonna film it because, you know, YouTube probably doesn't like it, but I literally just saw two people outside their car on the ground having sex in a supermarket parking lot. I have officially seen everything. That's, that, folks, that's what you get. When you're looking for Pokemon, what you actually get is two people having sex on the pavement in a parking lot in a grocery store. Just warning you, just warning you. You know, this whole journey seems to be less about Pokemon and more about seeing people do strange things. It's kind of sketchy here. I kind of want to get out and it's blurry. Okay, let's go actually catch some Pokemon now. All right, well, we're in the casino parking lot and it looks like we found some. You know, I feel bad that I'm, you know, I don't remember my Pokemon names. It's a Zubat. Let's get it. In the casino parking lot, it just attacked. Okay, that was rubbish. Let's, let's do it, let's try again. You know, this is really hard when it's on a mount. Let's try my other finger. People must be going, what the fuck are you doing with a camera? In fact, I'm sort of worried that the tripod that I'm using to use this camera kind of looks like a shotgun or something. Come on! Yeah, we got it after a bazillion tries. One, two, three. It's ours. Thank you, Casino Nanaimo. Also looking for sponsorships. Oh, there's people coming. This is going to be weird. All right, me. let's turn down CBC. We are turning left here because it looks like there's a stop just up this little little road here. Oh, this is a really bumpy road. Oh, I really need to replace my shocks and shock absorbers. Oh, this is not fun. Oh, bouncy, bouncy. We're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Okay. Ow. Oh. It dripped. Uh, oh. Jesus Christ. Okay. Here we are. We are at the Pokestop. Let's get some shit. There's a guy with a fishing rod walking across the street. I'm at the Nanaimo Museum and I got three Pokeballs. How delightful. I hope that was in focus. Anyways, here we are in the beautiful city of Nanaimo. You know, this is less about Pokemon and more about Nanaimo tourism. Tourism. And my, god damn it, my seat belt is on. Stop being on light. I'm angry. Can't find the stuff. I really hope cops don't come by or something. I probably look really sketchy. There is a guy walking down the street if it wants to focus. 
which it doesn't. So let's just focus on here, where we have another stop. There's a few zoo bats around here, but I really don't care about zoo bats. Pokeballs, four Pokeballs, awesome. All right, sit rep, I've managed to go through a few poke stops and get some Pokeballs. I've captured a few, I think I catched a, a per, the, I wanna say Peugeot, but that's not a Pokemon, that's a French car. Let's, let's take a look at my Pokemon. We've got a Charmander, obviously. That was the first one we got. A Sparrow. Yay, we got a Sparrow. Um, we got a Ratatat. And, you know, the one thing I like, we got the Zubat. The one thing I really like about this game is it doesn't have all the stupid new Pokemon that I have no idea who they are. It's just the original 100 and, well, it seems like it's 95 right now or a bit more than that. What was it? 100? 150 was the original amount? Now they have like... There's probably as many Pokemon as there are herpes viruses in the world. <laughs> Man. You know, I think I'm gonna change tactic and head out back to the country because... The thing is, I want to go walk around, but... It's kind of sketchy and this thing's like a thousand dollar camera that isn't mine. So... Oh, look at my hood ornament. So we're going to head out there. My battery's almost dead. Well, it's half, so we'll see. We'll see. Small car? Well, not exactly, but it'll work. So here we are in Ladysmith. Um, there I was originally in the actual town of Ladysmith, but there was a cop that was sort of driving around, and I was like the only person on the street. So, I really didn't feel like saying, Well, what are you doing tonight, sir? Um, I'm, uh, I'm out at like 12 o'clock at night playing Pokemon Go. Hmm. Are you a drug dealer by any chance, sir? No, I am not a drug dealer. Alrighty, so let's see what's around Lady Smith. It seems like there, there are Pokemon. What do we have here? It's a wild, ugh, it's kind of difficult when it's in a moat. Although it makes it a bit easier, I guess, because I don't have to throw as far. Oh, you're jumping now, are you? You little bum. Okay, this is hard to do when it's in a moat. Flick it! No, I'm going to run out of Pokeballs, aren't I? How many do I have left? Go! Okay, let's try the other finger. Go! Oh, you attacked like a little butt. Oh, now you're jumping around? Yeah, we got it, finally! One, two, yay! I really want to find a Meowth, though. Gotcha! And other stuff. New Pokemon 500 XP. Oh, it's, um, the, the Goldeen. I wonder how much XP we have. We're 66 CP. Not bad, not bad at all. Oh, I'm level 3 now. Two more levels to go before I can do, um, uh, battles with, um, it's too late. It's too late. Lodges. No, that's what Freemasons have. Um, you know, it's pretty hilarious. Even at this time of night, I just see people walking around with their phones out looking for Pokemon, and I am going to get this, whatever it is. There's a Jigglypuff around here, and I want to find it. Oh, there it is! It's the Jigglypuff! I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Yeah! Got the Jigglypuff. Yeah, look over. You probably can't see it, but there's a person just walking away with their phone out. And I've seen a few people just driving around the parking lot kind of weirdly. Because there's actually a lodge right here at the, the Ladysmith McDonald's. But yay, I have a Jigglypuff now. And my car is sort of idling bad, so I'm going to put it into neutral. That makes me pretty happy. Jigglypuff. There's another one behind... What else is around here? 
you know, it's pretty hilarious. Even at this time of night, I just see people walking around with their phones out looking for Pokemon, and I am going to get this, whatever it is. There's a Jigglypuff around here, and I want to find it. Oh, there it is. It's the Jigglypuff. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Yeah! Got the Jigglypuff. Yeah, look over. You probably can't see it, but there's a person just walking away with their phone out. And I've seen a few people just driving around the parking lot kind of weirdly. Because there's actually a lodge right here at the, the Ladysmith McDonald's. But yay, I have a Jigglypuff now. And my car is sort of idling bad, so I'm going to put it into neutral. That makes me pretty happy. Jigglypuff. There's another one behind... What else is around here? Um... I really want a Meowth. I've got enough of those dig diggeroos, whatever the hell they call I'm a bad Pokemon fan, aren't I? I used to be obsessed with this when I was a kid, and now I'm just forgetting everything. But I think I'm going to call that a night, because my battery's getting low, and there's only this can only be so interesting when I can barely see anything. So uh, this might be the video, or I might record some more tomorrow during the day. We'll see. Let's give you a nice um, shot of the outside so we can have like a, an ante, except <laughs> the camera only wants to focus on my dirty window, so forget it. Mr. Peckinpah is the director of an animal shelter in Muncie, Indiana. He has rescue dogs who need exercise. Interesting. Dogs he now cleverly calls Pokemon dogs. We reached Phil Peckinpah. I just got a squirt all, but what I really want is after playing, look at the moon, it's quite nice. After playing this for an evening, and yeah, it's been a bit cumbersome with the car and all and trying to hold the camera, but got to put high beams on. I don't want to run over any Pokemon. Um, this is a brilliant idea. Like, I think, like, obviously, it's pro this kind of idea is in its infancy, but I see people around, even at this time of night, walking around through parking lots, through town, and they're all just looking at their phone and groups of people, and I think it's fantastic. Um, and what is that? I see something. I see something in the road. Is it... Is that a dog? Oh no, it's a cat. <laughs> It's a kitty cat. You probably can't see it. I just saw its eyes glowing. I wonder if it's lost. <laughs> I caught myself a real Pokemon. It's a Meowth. It's a Meowth. All you see is black, I'm sure. All right, now I'm like driving down some back road where I'm most likely going to be killed. So I think that's where I'll leave that commentary for today. Uh, I wonder, I mean, it might not be, it might have been, a, there are cougars around here. It's awfully small for a cougar, but it may have been a baby. Um, but I'm going to try and turn around and get home before I get killed. So it was really fun doing this and I hope to do it in the future. So until then, see ya. I can't, my, my car veers really violently to the right.